Welcome to Aaron Lee and Friends. It's cold and blustery outside and warm and cozy inside, which means it's absolutely perfect for one of my very favorite winter tales, Bear Snores On by Karma Wilson. This is also one of my favorite tales to act out. So while you're listening to the story, think about how you would play one of these animals. How would you move like mouse or breathe like the bunny? Or most importantly, snore like bear because you are going to be in charge of all the snoring. Are you ready? Here we go. cave in a woods, in his deep, dark lair. Through the long, cold winter sleeps a great brown bear. Cuddled in a heap with his eyes shut tight, he sleeps through the day and he sleeps through the night. The cold winds howl and the night sounds growl, but the bear snores on. Itty bitty mouse, pitter pat, tiptoe, creep crawls in the cave from the fluff cold snow. Mouse squeaks, too damp, too dank, too dark. So he lights wee twigs with a small hot spark. The coals pip pop and the wind doesn't stop. But the bear snores on. Ho mouse, hair cries, long time no see. So they pop white corn and they brew black tea. Mouse sips, we slurps. <laughs> hair burps, big burps. <clears throat> but the bear snores on. A badger scuttles by at the air. I smell yummy yums, perhaps we can share. And they nibble and they munch with a chew, chomp, crunch. But the bear snores on. A gopher and a mole tunnel up through the floor. Then a wren and a raven flutter in through the door. They tweet and they titter and they chat and they chitter, but the bear snores on. In a cave in the woods, a slumbering bear sleeps through a party in his very own lair. Hair stokes the fire, mouse seasons stew, then a small pepper flake makes the bear <laughs> and the bear wakes up. <laughs> you snuck in my lair. You've all had fun. But me, I was sleeping and I've had none. <laughs> <laughs> and Mouse squeaks, don't fuss, don't fret, look, see, we can pop more corn, we can brew more tea. And Bear gulps, gobbles, and sighs with delight. Then he spins tall tails through the blustery night. When the sun peeks up, on a crisp, clear dawn, Bear can't sleep, but his friends snore on. Now that you know how the story goes, get up on your feet and act it out. Pretend you're one of the animals in the story. How does your animal feel when they're outside in the blustery cold? How do they feel when they're inside in the nice, warm, cozy den? 
And since this story is so much fun, go get your own copy. Get it from a bookstore or from your local library. And I'll see you next time. Okay, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. If you've performed one of our songs, email us. We'd love to hear about it. Our concerts are posted on our webpage and all our social media pages. The links are in the description box right below. See you next time.